now that I'm over here at the work table and I have a couple of files, I'm going to file out the inside of this. Right now, these pieces will not fit through this hole. So what I want to do is put this piece in the vise and clamp it firmly. But don't overdo it. We don't want to leave any dents in the piece of wood. I'm going to take a file, put it through the hole, and I'm going to pull sideways on this as I file. <laughs> And it's going to take off some of the rough edges that the mortiser had just left inside. We'll do the same on the other side. Make that nice and flat and smooth. The shorter edges are a little too narrow to put this big file through. So I have a smaller file here that I can use. But you got to be careful doing this because if you were to pull back on this, you could chip out some of the edge. So if I take this and put a small chamfer on the side by holding the uh, file at a 45 and only pushing into the block, It'll put like a little relief on the edge. So now when I file that flat surface, I don't get any tear out on the back side. You're going to have to do that to both the top and the bottom. when you're done doing this without too much effort, you should be able to take and push your block through. This one's still a little bit snug, so I'll have to file a little bit more to get that to fall through there. You don't want to have to put any pressure to put these through. It should just slide through nice and easy. Do this to every piece. Every opening, you need to be able to put a block through each way. Once all those are done, it'll be time to hand over to the power sander.